Have you ever tried to print a PDF only to find out that it's password protected? In today's video, I'll show you how to print a password protected PDF. Let's get started. Now, of course, things will be much easier if you know the password to the PDF file. In this situation, you just need to use Adobe Acrobat to get around the password. Remember, you will need to use Adobe Acrobat Pro to do this. Let me show you the specific steps. Here I have a password protected PDF file that I've opened with Adobe Acrobat. First, click on the file option in the top left corner, then select properties. In the pop-up menu, select security. Beside the security method, hit the drop-down menu and choose no security. You'll need to re-enter the password to complete this change. After these steps, save the file to apply the changes. Open it again, and you'll find that there's no longer any password restrictions. Now, of course, this is an ideal situation when we actually know the password. But what if we don't? Things will be a bit more complicated, but rest assured that we'll be able to handle it. Allow me to introduce Passper for PDF. Passper is a professional software which helps to remove restrictions from PDF files in an efficient and easy way. Since it doesn't require any internet connection, none of your information will be sent to a server, which means your data is secure. Now let's see how easy it is to use Passper for PDF and how fast it can be when removing restrictions. I've already downloaded and installed it on my computer, so I'll go ahead and open it up. Here, we can see two different options on the home interface. We need to remove the permissions password to get the PDF file printed. So here, we'll choose Remove Restrictions. The Recover Passwords option is for recovering forgotten or lost passwords to open locked PDF files. After that, we add the encrypted PDF file to the software and simply click the Remove button. And, quickly and easily, it's done. Let's take a look. Notice that the Print button is no longer grayed out and we can now print the file. Pretty cool, right? If you're interested in trying Passper for yourself, just click the download link in the video description below. It's our guarantee that you'll love Passper. That wraps up today's video. If you have any suggestions or requests for a future video, please let us know in the comment section down below. We'd love to hear from you. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribing. Your support really means a lot. Thanks again and see you in the next video.